Welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about the severe weather that we have going on now. And also, we have more severe weather coming on Sunday. Unfortunately, with that possibility, there's also tornadoes. So right now, if you take a look, we have a strong thunderstorm moving through upstate New York right now. These severe thunderstorm warnings say that there's nickel-sized hail in this storm and 60 mile an hour wind gusts. Possible impact, expect damage to roofs, siding, and trees. Now taking a look in Georgia, there's no severe weather going on right now, and hopefully it stays like that. Uh, just last night, unfortunately, here in Noonan, very unfortunate what happened, I'm sure you heard. Giant tornado, probably an EF3, EF4, swiped through the town. Mind you, population 40,000. And it was nighttime. Most people, I'm sure, were probably sleeping, so they didn't really know it was coming. Uh, seven deaths have been reported. I'm not too sure if that's just Noonan alone or if that's the whole outbreak itself yesterday. But either way, seven too many. Now, taking a look at the HRR model, this storm should be mostly out of here by tonight, if not Saturday morning. Mind you, it's going to be beautiful this weekend. Pretty much the whole eastern part of the country, it's going to be beautiful. If you live in the Rockies, obviously, it's going to be cold and snowy. But like I said, come Sunday, we're not out of the woods. Now, Saturday, we could see some storms develop in the Ohio Valley. But that's nothing compared to what's going to happen as we go into Sunday. We have this low-pressure system, and we're going to have storms developing along the front. We have warm, moist, gulf air feeding these storms. Now, like I said, there's a good chance that we could see some tornadoes. This time, it's aimed at Tennessee and parts of northern Mississippi and Arkansas. But then again, I think we also should worry about parts of Virginia and maybe even all the way up through Pennsylvania and parts of New Jersey. Let's take a look at the surface base cape. As you can see, we're going to have a lot of instability on Saturday and Sunday for parts of the Ohio Valley and the South. On Sunday, look at Virginia flare up. A lot of instability, and it even goes into parts of Pennsylvania, Delmarva, and maybe even New Jersey can get some of that. But here's my concern. As we look at the significant tornado parameter, you can see it gets pretty intense, especially in Arkansas and parts of Tennessee. But as that cold front pushes by on Sunday, you know, we get a more stable atmosphere, and hopefully that will keep the tornado threat. But... Virginia flares up, and look at the chances of seeing a tornado in Virginia. Now, mind you, this is a couple days out. This will change, but this is very concerning, obviously. Any tornado threat is concerning. I'm going to do a box sounding in eastern Virginia, and you can see possible hazard-type tornado. We have that instability. We have the warm air. We have the moisture. We have the wind shear. It's all there for a possible tornado. So yeah, I'll be sure to keep you posted. New video out tomorrow morning, so if you want to see that, please like and possibly subscribe so you can come back and watch it. I really would appreciate it. But then again, thank you so much for watching.